Hi, friends. We're at the fifth and the final joyful mystery of the rosary. The finding of the child Jesus in the temple. And this one is probably one that I understand really well. But when I tried to, for a long time, when I tried to relate it, it's not the easiest. So let me tell you what the story is. Um, Mary and Joseph bring Jesus to the temple. And there are other things that are going on in Jerusalem. And then everyone is going home. And this happens year after year at that time of the year. And it takes three days before they realize that Jesus isn't with them because they travel in these large groups in those days. And so they go back and they look for him and they finally find him in the temple and he's talking with the teachers, listening and talking. He's 12 years old. And they're fascinated by him. And of course, Mary and Joseph are upset because they couldn't find him. And Jesus says, Why would you look any place else, basically, than my father's home? When I am challenged by where do I fit in this world, when I'm challenged by looking for things that are right in front of me. That's when I really connect to this fifth joyful mystery. Because more and more, I can see that what happens every single day of our life can become very routine and mundane. We don't live in roller coasters and excitement. And I was talking with a good friend tonight about this sub subject. And it's challenging because we can think, what? A is this all there is? But when I find myself challenged by, is this all there is? I realize that that's the time that I really need to be in my father's house. And that can be figuratively or literally. I need to unite myself to the divine because I'm here for a reason. But it's not always easy to see what that reason is. And the closer, the more closely connected we are, the easier it is to just stay on the path. I 
I hope this helps. And thanks for letting me share these mysteries. Sending you so much love.